Amy Robach and TJ Holmes moving on just months after affair was revealed. Amy Robach and TJ Holmes hinted to the world that their relationship may be getting more serious when they were spotted in New York this week making a telltale visit to a real estate agent. The former GMA3 host suggested they were making plans to purchase a new home together, only months after their romance was made public last year. Amy and TJ, who were fired from their roles on the ABC show due to their affair, were photographed arriving and leaving the reality company where they spent an hour. This would be a big step for the duo who were firm friends and colleagues before their relationship turned romantic. They shocked the nation when photos surfaced of them packing on the PDA during a Thanksgiving vacation. Both parties were in 12-year marriages. Amy has now divorced Melrose Place actor, Andrew Hsu, and TJ is also divorcing Marilee Feebig, who is the mother of his youngest child, Sabine. On January 27 a statement from an ABC spokesman was released which read, after several productive conversations with Amy Robach and TJ Holmes about different options, we all agreed it's best for everyone that they move on from ABC News. We recognize their talent and commitment over the years and are thankful for their contributions. They have since refrained from posting on social media, with TJ removing his entirely. The pair are believed to have bonded while training for a marathon together. He called her his best friend in an interview with the New York Post which was published before their affair was revealed. When asked by the publication how he feels about his role on the ABC show, he admitted, I am a really, really lucky dude. I am now in my absolute dream job. And I get to sit next to my best friend doing it. His comments came ahead of him running the New York Marathon with Amy and he added, I never ever ever could have imagined things working out the way they have. The interview was from October, and at the time, he was unaware he would be taken off the air weeks later.